Aloha and half a day is currently Tuesday, February 11th, NSC vlog number five. And today, Austin has an exercise from 7 a.m. to 7 p.m. So that's a 12 hour shift for him. However, for me, I normally take his car to go to school in the morning because it works out with his normal schedule, which is from 3 p.m. to 11 at night. So today I will be walking to school from my apartment and hopefully it turns out well. But I pretty much know my way to school since school is right maybe like five minutes away when you're driving. I took a look on Google Maps and, and the estimate walking arrival to campus would be about 20 to 25 minutes but that all depends on myself and how how fast I can go so I have my Nike running shoes today I'm not gonna run but I will be walking and walking comfortably and I also have my Nike visor so that I can protect myself from the sun because here on Guam, if you haven't visited yet, the weather here, it's sometimes it'll be pretty, sometimes it'll be muggy and humid, but today's weather, if I could show you, this is how the weather looks. It's super sunny. And hopefully I don't die, so. I also have my hydro flask prepared as well so that I can hydrate on the way and take some breaths. And hopefully I run into some classmates who are able to hitch me a ride, but that's not a guarantee. So I'll be vlogging my walking and I'll be showing you the neighborhood as well just so that you guys can keep me company. So please stay tuned and thank you for watching. As of right now, I'm on foot. And the weather today is pretty nice. It's not as beaming with sun rays right now. And I said morning to a couple of the neighbors in the neighborhood. Right now, I'm currently walking to school. And as I mentioned, the estimated time arrival would be about 20 to 25 minutes. Google Maps said it was 27 minutes, but I'm gonna try to beat that time. A little bit hot though. I do have my running shoes on, my leggings and my hat. And right now we're going through here. Let me see how that goes. There's a speed bump back there. And um, looks like I have my watch as well. So we'll see how everything goes today. Working up a sweat a little bit, but let me show you the view right now. It's pretty nice. You want to take a right over here. This is the end of the street. Now here is GCC, so this is Guam Community College. Let's see. Okay. Yay, we made it to school on time. I just got back home from walking from school. I timed myself from my apartment to school, it was about a 25 minute walk. And it was really nice with the weather because it was pretty breezy. Coming back to, uh, sorry, coming back home, um, the weather got a little bit hot. It was, it's a little bit muggy out there. So I, don't mind me if I'm a little bit oily right now, but I made it back in one piece. I found my way home and 
uh, I find I found my way safely in my sociology class this morning I mentioned to my professor that I walked from my apartment to campus this morning and she was just shocked because she was just letting me know how to be careful because there are not crimes but there are accidents there's a lot on Guam apparently and uh, these accidents are more of the motor vehicle accidents because if you notice on Guam there's not much sidewalks here not official ones either so if you're gonna be walking to places it all depends on where you live either in you know like the boondocks or somewhere small some place that's not closest to the city which is you know the city life is more busy um, and more attractive rather than in like country sides and other places and other villages here on Guam it's more spacious and more less busy so that I think that's why because of the population here on Guam and the villages where people live it all just depends on how busy it gets so from where I live right now from where I'm staying right now it's a uh, it's a small village and these roads here are pretty rocky i should say they're not like smooth clean roads that you would see in hawaii they're more of like dirt roads um, a lot of dust in the air too but i'm back at home so thank god i'm gonna go make me a sandwich now thank you for watching oh my gosh there's so many chickens 